Hello everyone, welcome to another exciting and very short episode of the Eora Covenant. In the last couple of episodes I was going over by a major degree, but in this one I'm actually going really short. I'm just kind of squeezing it in um, to um, just kind of go over some things. Um, last episode I was going to colonize a total of five new systems for at least five new worlds. Um, and so I, I figured out a way of doing it to where I would get three new systems, not throwing me over my cap. Um, it's going to be this system right here, this system right here, this system right here. This would give me a lot of territory over here to kind of like, maybe we'll, we'll bump up this area, connect to this, uh, at least I'm hoping this would connect to this. Um, I might be a little bit too far away, um, if I feel like I'm... I don't know, maybe that might be, that might be a stretch, because it might not be close enough, now that I think about it. Hmm. Um, I might have to colonize this planet first before I get to this planet, but this, this planet, this system has three planets, and so I thought it would be really cool to be able to kind of get this far out. But, um, and it might mean that I might have to um, colonize this planet too, just to kind of connect those two. But I was going to do uh, this, 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 and this. Um, and then, um, I'm sorry, correction. What did I say? Uh, this, this, and this is what I was going to be I'm colonizing. So those three right there, that would push me over, um, to uh, three. And then I was also going to colonize uh, this tropical world in this system, and I was going to. Um, hmm. There's another. I was colonizing. I think I'm pushing myself. Oh yeah, pushing myself over the cap by one, um, because I was gonna colonize the system and this system, um, I mean, a planet in this system, just to kind of push out my territory this far, um, and maybe um, hopefully I'll be able to connect this um, to this and get the the four and the four here for the minerals, and maybe even push it far enough to maybe capitalize on these. Um, I'm gonna be over my cap by one. That'll reduce um, my energy production um, by 10%, and I might reduce my influence by 10%, and maybe some other thing, but um, it's going to come out very well for me because I'm going to get a lot of territory at one time, um, and then um, as my as things start to really start to fill in, um, it's going to take some time to fill in, but um, then I'm going to um, I'm going to make this whole sector over here. Um, I'm gonna make all of this a sector on its, on its own, and I'm going to uh, fill in. Like I'm gonna colonize this planet. I'm gonna colonize this planet. I'm gonna colonize this planet next. Um, just so, like this, this, this one is just so I can um, fill all of that in. And then I'm gonna get rid of um, this uh, frontier outpost. If I don't have to have a frontier outpost, I certainly won't have it. Um, so um, it'll be nice to be able to uh, have. All that space back, um, space back, um, and also eventually, um, I'm hoping that um, as I expand my territory and colonize all of those, um, and, and you know, as my population expands, I won't have to be so dependent on these frontier outposts either. Hopefully, colonizing these two worlds would get pushed this kind of out a little bit more. Um, you know, I realized suddenly that I never actually. Um, built a mining station right there. It doesn't really help now because I'm going to colonize the world, but I didn't build a mining station for this right here. Um, so there's a few things that I missed that I won't miss after this. Um, I still have to figure out what I'm going to do about this whole space over here because um, I can't capitalize, I can't colonize this world. It's tomb world. I'm never going to colonize that. Um, I have all this space that I can't occupy, so I'm probably going to build outposts over here, and so I'm going to need to... Um, remove them where I don't need them, so eventually I won't have one over here, but I'll still have access to all of those, um, you know, all of the living metal that's going to come from this section right here. I'm going to have, like, a lot of living metal. Um, I'm going to have, um, let's see, all that research. They're going to have all that research. Um, I'm going to have, I'm just going to kind of get Tile this going. I'm just gonna get the keep I'm still releasing tile blocker the, cleared. The, the tile blockers. Um, from the last episode I got that text where the, the tile research. 
so that I can now remove all these tile blockers. And on this planet too. Let's see, that's almost done. Let's see, all the tile blockers we got on that planet. Still working on those. Incoming transmission. Um, this guy is going to go right here. Um, I'm going to build. I am so ready right now to build this Batherium power plant. I've been waiting forever for that. I'm going to get that one up to like level three. Um, it's going to be like the, the only thing on this planet that's going to be built um, right away. Um, then I'm going to be able to get all this research, all this physics research that I've, well, almost except for this one, but um, most of this planet is going to be available except for these two blocks, um, which maybe I'll research next um, if it allows me to. Um, but I'm going gonna, gonna to be able to System get um, all these minerals too now. I'm going to be able to utilize these minerals that I've been I'm unable to access, then I'm going to have all those new worlds that are going to give me access to more minerals, so... Colonization um, in progress. It's going to, it's going to be, um, it's going to be a big shift. Tile blocker cleared. Um, in the next, um, 20 years, it's going to be a big shift for my, um, for my, my empire. Um, the Covenant is going to just expand so much, so quickly. Um, it's going to hurt us on research, um... But um, we've been doing so well with research that at this point, um, it won't hurt. I mean, it'll hurt us, but it won't hurt us because we're also going to be in, able to build more mining, more more um, research um, labs on on these planets. Tile blocker cleared. Right there, all the tile blockers on this planet. I did. I did. Um, so, um, well, eventually at one point what I'll do is, I'll just, um, I'm just going to leave it alone. I'm going to let time pass, and I'm going to let them populate and just fill all of these, um, fill all of these up on their own, and then I'll kind of build, um, once I, you know, accumulate a nice bit of, um, minerals, um, and then I'll just kind of, like, build all the buildings and let them grow, and then upgrade them, and let them go, and then, you know, um, cause, that's that, that's the way to do it. Although a few things I will build, like for instance, um, I um, I know that it doesn't really cost too much as far as um, a drain on the economy to pre-build um, mining, I mean, power plants in advance. They don't drain energy like the other things do. So I might um, pre-build. Um, power plants on some of these planets. Colonization in progress. Colonization in progress. Alright. So we've got tolerance is being built. It's being colonized. We have um, sincerity is being colonized. Um, and um, I tried to focus on um, for the most part I think there's only one planet Tile block that's clear. not going to be one of our um, um, like 85% or 100% habitability. I wanted to choose the worlds that will be easy to colonize first. Um, then I'm going to use the um, get the planets that can um, that will require um, more um, more attention. Um, like the, like there are some planets that I wanted to um, see. There's one right here that's like 20 as a desert world. But it's only 45%. Now I could build the visitor center and put up to 50%. But then you also have to think about, you know. System survey complete. Uh oh. There's a trade deal that they requested? Okay, I forgot about that. Okay, I. I my bad. Where is this guy? Oh, he's unemployed. Get over here, bro. Um, let us build. Well. First, let's build these mining. These mines, and then once we built these mines, um, then we'll build um, this thing. But we need, those, we need those minerals. We need those minerals. I'm just gonna clear this blocker. There we go. Gonna clear this blocker. There we go. I'm gonna get rid of all those blockers. I hate those blockers. So now that I actually have the ability to remove them, I am on a mission to get rid of all of them. All of them. All of them. Let's see, a power plant right here, a power plant right here, so I'm going to build a power plant right here too. Um, and then I'm going to build a... Uh... First I guess I'll build over here, I'll build an energy grid. Because it doesn't cost anything to build an energy grid, I see the 
that's not gonna go off. <laughs> Cause we any influence or anything. Um, Tile blocker cleared. Any maintenance, so build that. Build a little power plant. Only 16 minerals. I mean, that's a lot actually, but. Um, we'll get there. Then as they populate, they'll start working there. Let's see. Power plant right here, so I'm gonna build one right here too. For this guy to get a job. There we go, he's there. Sha la la la, sha la la la, good job. Um, okay. Uh, silliness, silliness, silliness. And the great thing is, I'm gonna be able to manage all of these. I'm really excited about the um, the multi-system planets because I'm um, I've only got four systems under my control, but I'm gonna be able to manage. I managed five, and um, as I get all those other ones in, um, there's one if system I, fleet. I didn't do. That's wait, what? What the heck? Pause. Oh wow, okay, that is scary. Why do you go that route? Why would he go that route? There was... Okay, maybe the, um... You know what, this power fleet must be moving. They must be, um... Because I don't know why this guy would go this way. It's kind of, kind of silly. Really. I'm so confused. Oh, I see. We cleared out this space. Um, I was going to colonize these worlds, um, but I won't just. Whoa! Hold on a second. They're building a colony right here. Um, can I cancel that colonization? No, it's too late. Oh no, they're building a colony right here, um, so I want to um, I want to make sure that they don't get access to all these three worlds, um, because I do want to uh, take the Alpine world, the Tundra world, I'm going to build another colony ship, this is kind of going overboard here, but I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. Um, because I do want to... Um, <clears throat> I don't need that world. So, um, I mean those worlds. I mean, I don't really need them, but I just don't want to lose them. Um, now how is this going to connect with this? I don't think it's going to connect at all. It's not going to connect to this system, or this system. It's just going to be freestanding over here. But, I mean, that's three planets in that system that I could, that I could definitely colonize. I, I can definitely take that uh, ocean world, the Tundra World and Alpine. I'm being greedy. I'm just going to calm down a second here. Um, so I, I'm kind of being greedy, but I'm kind of not being greedy. Um, because um, I realize that if I colonize this world and this world, they'll connect my space with these guys. Um, They, they, they will connect our space. This this is gonna kind of you guys are gonna probably think this guy's crazy, um, but we'll see what's gonna happen here. Um, I said to accumulate more more minerals now. I realize here because this is um, this is this might be a wait and see moment here. I don't think that they um they can't colonize the way they System can colonize the ocean world. Complete. So I suppose in a way they might. I'm just worried that their space is gonna push us, um, push this into their territory. Um, if this expands, it's gonna expand outward this way. Um, it might just tile blocker cleared. Encompass. We we might just be just right outside of their range. 
um, of their space. So, I'm gonna send my science ship very quickly. Where's my science ship here? Where are you, sir? Okay, you, good, nice friend, are going to survey these planets. Just survey. And then you're going to survey this. Survey this. Great. The ships are doing okay. This one's here, this one's here. So, one's about to start colonizing this planet, and then this guy's gonna be over here. He's gonna take that planet, and this guy, he's still got a long way to go before he can get there. So, it's gonna be an incremental. And okay, this one's colonizing, so I'm gonna have. This is in our space now? Excellent. So I can start to uh, build some Construction stuff. complete. Where are you? He's right here. He's way over there. Okay, that's good for them. I'm going to have to build another construction ship because I'm not going well, I'm not sending all the way back over here. He's going to build um, this. So we have those resources. Colonization in progress. Colonization in progress. Um, this is exciting. Let's see how far are we in the trap from finishing. He's still got a little bit of way to go. It's not going to push as far over as I hoped it would, but we'll see. Because I think I'm getting close. These are three colonies right here. Um, colonization over here impacts over here. It doesn't really impact. Um, colonization over here doesn't really impact our space over here. Incoming okay. transmission. Incoming transmission. Um, should not be prisoners. Um, we agree. Well, we already agreed to this. Okay, those guys agreed. Okay, so they, they want to uh, migrate over to our worlds. Which makes sense because they are arid worlds. What? Doesn't make any sense. I didn't, I didn't actually colonize the uh, desert world yet. I was going to colonize the desert world. I haven't quite done that yet. But now that I now that I, now I can, and I probably will. in progress. Um, and they'll they'll be able to um, colonize our worlds. They'll be able to colonize our worlds because these guys are arid guys too. Um, that's I will do a desert world at some point. At some point soon. Maybe not this one, but the one in this system. Size twenty two. Colonies going there. Okay, that's still there. That's gonna be there. Hopefully, these are all connect nicely. But we'll see the end results um, pretty soon. I'm going. I'm setting this one fastest so I can hopefully um, the time frame. Okay, we only got like Tiles six minutes left before I gotta end this episode. A little over six minutes. So um, I'm not really sure these are all gonna colonize before I'm finished with this episode because I still have complete. Uh, Tolerance actually completed. Okay. 45. Okay, so we gotta pause this for a quick second. Actually, I don't have to. Um, but I am going to build right here a visitor center. Yep. <laughs> It's gonna take that one like um, a couple. It's gonna take this one a couple days. I need more leaders. Um, I'm gonna have to start researching and getting more leaders so I can um, have a governor on all these planets. Um, because having having um, having governors is gonna make a big difference. System for survey us complete. So that um, we can maintain happiness on all these planets and. Um, um, how many leaders do I have? Accessible. So I need I can I can always uh wait a second. 
Oh yeah, I was, um, one of my scientists isn't being utilized. Colony I built established. another colony ship, I realize. Um, he is going to this system. I think we'll be good. Actually, I think this isn't going to stretch out that way. I might just destroy that colony ship. Um, I'll leave it on the back burner. I'm not going to destroy it, but I'll just leave it on the back burner. Research agreement with these guys? Sure. Why not? Tile blocker cleared. So we're making we're making good ties with these guys. They're uh, they're on really terms with this. Do they want to join a federation? No. War philosophy. Ah. Uh, Forbids wars of aggression. Okay, so they don't want to go do that. Well, Monkadir Sablisur. Oh yes, look at this. This is perfect. I can invite them to the Federation. This is what I've wanted this entire time. Is that one? Probably because of distance or something. But I'm going to invite them. This is wonderful. So they're going to Federation formed. Federation System formed. Complete. Yes, this is beautiful. <laughs> Our dream is coming true. And um, to just completely correlate with my book, um, I am going to. This is going to be called um, the not the Italata, the Ilata. Um, but this is going to be the Galactic Cooperative Council, um, because that was what it was. The Yora were part head of the Galactic Cooperative Council in my book, The Catalyst. So there we go, Galactic Cooperative Council. Boom shakalaka. Now I'm going to pause this very quickly and just going to scan this. Can I, with these guys, invite them into the Federation? Acceptance. Okay, um, we need you guys to uh, offer associate status. Okay, confirm and accept. Yes. So, in a short time, these guys are going to join our federation, um, which is good because we're going to get a bonus now to our unity of plus five percent. Federation members plus 10%, so that's me, um, just by the ER being in a federation, we get a plus 5%, and the humans give us another plus 5%, so let's get a plus 10%, um, and if I can just do one thing to incoming boost their opinion of us, um, I'm just going to pause this for a second here, um, incoming transmission, so I'd, would you consider granting us, agree, of course we want to grant them, yes. Vote oh, yes. Yes. Haha. <laughs> so these guys um, are now an associate status. Association status, that's great. Now, still a hard fought idea of getting them to uh, agree to. Um... But who knows? Maybe they'll change their war philosophy over time. This is really good. This is really successful for us. A lot of good stuff is happening right now. Incoming transmission. Our territory is expanding. Let's see. Hold on a second. These guys, the citizen regime of Rock uh, want to join the Associates. <laughs> Sorry. Living outside the question of membership, would you like to grant an association status? Agree. So, we agree. Um, in order to offer. Okay. So we got all this down. Construction uh, complete. We're glad to have this opportunity. Wonderful. So we're all friends now. We're all friends. This is such of a joyous Tile occasion. Um, such a joyous occasion for all of us. And with that, that's going to be the um, closure of complete. this episode. In this episode, we. We're expanding our territory. Complete. Um, I don't see that coming up just yet as a colonization option, but this is going to be all connected. Um, this, this, this. Hopefully. Hopefully. If not, I might have to do this world. 
that will connect all of this. Um, I can I can maybe hold off on taking this if I just can get all of these worlds connected to each other, um, um, because I do don't want to just have like a bunch of scattered worlds. Colonization in progress. Or maybe not. That's already started. All right, but we are going to get all those um, minerals. Start to integrate. Okay, integration's fine with me. That's okay. What are these guys doing? And yeah, so this is good. I can actually clear out most of those tile blockers if I wanted to. And so, but I'm not going to go too crazy. Uh, we've already kind of gone overboard on our colonization. Um, that'll be my next project. Um, is um, actually. Oh man, this is crazy. We're doing good though, we're doing good. Where's Harmony at? Is this Harmony? Nope, this one's um, Sincerity. Sincerity is finished. Uh, we didn't pull as much into our territory as we thought we would. Actually, no, we did. We did. This is going to build. Tile blocker cleared. Buying stations right here. Um, we, uh, we don't have this in our space like we wanted to, but we'll get that once we colonize this um, sometime in the near future. Um, point is, we just want to get some more boots on the ground, more, more homes, more civilizations built, and then we'll start working on the other stuff. And just, but that's going to be the next episode. Um, you're going to see. And we're now part of the great galactic sorry we're not part of the galactic cooperative council um we've got a total of um two members so far two more members on the way um assuming that they um can agree to things like um, come on guys hold on i'm gonna do something nice like bribe them again i'm gonna bribe these guys so let's say offer trade deal um I gotta do something to get these guys on board. Instance transfer of the sailing. Okay, they don't really don't care about minerals, do they? Okay, maybe they do. There we go. One thousand. Oh yes. There we go. I bribed them. Now they're gonna join the Federation. And now we have another member of the Federation. <laughs> All it cost it was one thousand minerals. Um, <laughs> but look at that. Now our Federation members. Plus 15% and decided to end their. What? Oh no, the Rock to Lock Knock decided to end their associate status with the Galactic Covenant. Of... Okay, well, I guess they don't like them. So they decided they didn't want to be with the rest of us. Ah, oh, come on, guys. What was this about? They disliked the Pentelman United States. That's so petty. That's so petty, guys. Like, they didn't have to go that route. Um, or we can at least get a migration treaty. Oh, but they're slaving despots. Oh, that's right, they are slavers, aren't they? So they... Why would we want to uh, have a migration treaty with these guys when they enslave people? All right. Um, on second thoughts, I guess we're not all friends. Friendly attitude, at least for the time being, but... Um, all of that's going to fade pretty soon, um, unless we maintain our research agreement. Um, but that's such a sad thing. I really thought that we were all going to be best friends, but these guys are more likely to agree with us than you guys are, because these guys are pacifists, so they don't believe in aggressive wars. Um, which means two things could happen. One, um, we could end up going to war with these guys, um, or two, they could change their ways. Um, we'll see which one it will be. But it's going to be weird for them because they're going to be surrounded by us. These guys are going to keep expanding. These guys are going to keep expanding. We are obviously going to keep expanding. Um, so we'll see what goes on with that. Um, but um, yeah, exciting. Until next time. Um, 
we have a federation. Established. So, we've got colonies, we've got everything established, we are just moving all along with all these, all these new worlds. So, let's see what happens next. Looks at that plus 91. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. We are on the move. We are on the move. On the move. The move is on. The move is on. on, on. Um, <laughs> I don't. I don't know what happened with that. Uh, don't ask me. Um, I'm me, but don't ask me. Um, but anyway, well, you all have a wonderful day and um, anomaly found. Uh, God be with you.